okay? It's a silhouette to me with the rotten sun. The musket of a river. Old bastard outdoors. On a group trip. We got Joe and we got Georgina. And we got Matt. And we got Mike back there in his fancy old kayak. We are right there. Yeah. It's that micro cameras. Oh, from right there. <laughs> So two nights, three days, fishing on the Muscadot River. What's that? Well, oh, I didn't really think, yeah. I wanna pull, I wanna wait for him. There it is. Woo, we're loving this. Labor Day weekend, Muscat River. The waters are a little low. There's Mike up there coming down. He's got a, one of them paddle kayaks. Pedal. Oh, old Georgina. She won't get out of the canoe. And following, coming up the backside there is Maddie. This, last year this was set of rabbits, this year is like walking. Oh yeah, baby. Gonna love this. The plus side is the water's so low, if it gets windy, we're in like a tunnel. He'll never reach us. Okay. Stay tuned. Old Bastard 2018 Mustard Art River annual Labor Day weekend canoe trip. Go grab yourself a drink, pull up a chair, get comfy for all kinds of silly adventure. Okay, we're just stopping for lunch. The river is crazy though. Old Mr. Joe sipping on his lunchtime beer. Matt finished up making his coffee. And we'll pan over this way. That's how low it is. I've never paddled this river this low. Like, here's the banks. On the plus side, we've seen this crazy ass buck with a full rack going. So, be good hunting back here. In the fall, not to say that that he's going to still be here, but it's about eleven thirty in the morning. Slightly overcast, winds are mild, four to five mile an hour. When we get the gusts, otherwise nada. So we're gonna keep on going, check things out, see if we can find a camp spot for tonight. Down past Alder Bank. Cruising along. I think it's around 12 31 o'clock. My trusty stuffed beaver up on the front of the canoe, watching over rocks. This is awesome. Holy God, I love this river. So we got a 20% chance of rain today. Just a few clouds, but nothing too drastic. And probably around 21 degrees, 22 degrees out. Joe, Georgina, and Matt are up ahead. 
checking things out. And we're looking for a spot. Georgina said it looked like Algonquin. It's a bunch of large pine. So Mike is coming behind me in his kayak. I'm gonna catch up with these folks because I don't, I don't think they realize that they're uh, look at the size of a sweeper. I don't think they realize that they're passing or come up to where they were talking about paddling. So, uh, while I can think of it, I'll put a shout out to thank Short and Sassy for, she supplied the shirts for today. So at no cost to us, she donated them for our trip. Which also Short and Sassy, woohoo, make rock. Rock. <laughs> also, Here's my wife. That might have a little bit of an influence on it. But anyway, doesn't matter. Short and sassy custom creations. Looking for some Declan shirts, cups, all that fun stuff. Feel free to give her a shout. I'll put a link in the bottom down below that you can tag or contact with her. Here's a Facebook page. Okay, folks, let you go for now. Let's see if we can find somewhere to go camping. Yeah. Brought the Gone Boy 650 from All Coast Tents with me this weekend, too. Give that a go. Brought the candle lantern, which you saw me do the modification with the oil lamp in it. And guess what? I bought candles. Explain that later, or I probably have in the review. All right, it'll we'll go for a swim later too. My buddy Beaver, buddy Beaver, watching the way, watching for rocks, keeping his eye on Joe. Let's see what there. Right there. I don't like the sound of that bridge. <laughs> it is just after one o'clock. We just checked the clock phone. And we're just looking for a campsite. We've probably done about 15, 18 kilometer today. Something like that, I don't know. So we're looking for something all fancy smancy. I think it's coming up here. I'll turn around here. This is awesome. I can't believe it. I didn't realize that. Get down here so you can get a view. <laughs> it's one o'clock in the afternoon. Look at the glass. Look at these like sheets of glass people. But we're trying to find the camp space. Which I think might be just up ahead there. Which looks like it looks like the end of the river, but this one o'clock in the afternoon and it's like a sheet of glass. You couldn't ask for a better paddling situation. Here's the tip of the day then. The Muscat River is an actually highly used river. So if you decide to come out and paddle this, pack it in, pack it in. That's the rule. You pack it in, you pack it in. Woohoo! 
After a full day of paddling, we are here at our campsite. I got the tent set up there. Matt and Joe and Mike got their tent set up. Look at this awesome spot here. Georgina says it's like Algonquin in Ontario. I don't know. Never been there, but it's good. Mike has hammock going on back there. So we're going to get some wood. Right through here. What a beautiful area. We're going to go for a swim later. So the water's like, it's crystal clear. I can't believe it. It's amazing. So I got the Katana Boy 650 from Wild Coast Tents, which is the next best thing to a run in a chainsaw, but you're all stealthy and everything, so nobody will ever know what's going on. And keep in mind, we're only cutting down the deadwood. We're not cutting down the green trees. Green trees are no good here for a fire. So the group of us are all getting together. As I hike through here to get some wood. Team effort. There's five of us here in total. And there's all kinds of stuff here that's dead. That we're going to just pick up, take back, and have a beautiful fire this evening. So I think it's around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm not positive, so right, warm around here. What's going on so far today? Okay, well, we passed one other, or two other, two other canoes on the river here. Uh, Joe's seen a huge buck. Two canoes on the river. Look at this. Crazy old trees back here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. This stuff is still living. So. Okay, folks, let you go. Check back to you shortly. Maybe after supper there. We're going, as I said, we're going to go for a swim. Have some fun. So, peace, everyone. <whistles> Getting it on. That's nothing. Yeah, it is. There's something. D -d -d. Five o'clock on Saturday. Muscadine River. We're heckling it out there over <laughs> supper. <laughs> Mike got the, the beak on.